Welcome back to The Handy Landlord. I wish I was excited to make this video, but unfortunately, I think one of the hardest things in life is to admit when you made a mistake or you were wrong. I created a video about refinishing concrete, a set of concrete steps at my actual, my own personal house. I refinished the concrete steps and unfortunately they're failing. I don't think it's the Portland cement that's failing. I think it's actually um, the bond between the Portland cement and the um, rapid set mortar mix didn't adhere. So the rapid set mortar mix is down here and the Portland cement is up here. I painted on the Portland cement with the rapid set probably still wet. So and not fully cured. So I've never used rapid set mortar mix to fill in the pits and voids ever before that was this was the first time that i've ever used that i've always used hydraulic cement um because i've always had extra hydraulic cement and it was just my go-to and then i would go over top of that hydraulic cement with portland cement kind of like a slurry mix and paint the concrete basically so on my own patio that's failing i actually used a product called rapid set mortar mix to fill in all the pits and voids and then I went over that immediately. I didn't let it dry. I went over that immediately with uh, Portland cement and painted on a layer of Portland cement. Unfortunately, it is cracking. It's chipping up. It seems like everywhere that I had the rapid set, it is chipping up. I'll show you that now. So right here, you can see how easily the Portland cement scrapes off of the rapid set mortar mix. But one thing I noticed is that the rapid set mortar mix is not chipping up. It's, it seems like it's on there pretty good. And I've actually worked some more and I, I can't, it, it seems to be on there really good. So that brings me to what product should I use to refinish my concrete steps? So here's what I have. I want one product. I want one product that is going to fill cracks, voids in the concrete you know, that I can kind of fill in a low spot with it, you know, and and maybe have to re-slope something that I can patch a large area and build up to three, four inches. Every mistake that I've ever made, I've always learned something and I've always tried to get better. And I feel like I'm getting better because I feel like now I'm coming up with a product that is going to solve all my problems. It's rapid set cement all. Um, it's supposed to cure the structural strength in an hour. It sets super quick, uh, anchoring. I mean, just all these things. One thing, I mean, I think I read all the instructions on every set or every rapid set bag at Home Depot. I think I read everything I could possibly read on these. I did a ton of research. I watched all the rapid set videos, but one thing I noticed is that this product doesn't have any aggregate or uh, rocks, uh, n nothing large. So I'll be able to take it to like, basically, I'm hoping that I can take the product to like a zero clearance and or zero, you know, feather it out type of thing. So I'm going to use this product in a future video. So that's my story on my uh, failure. I still think that Portland Cement is a great paint product to top coat uh you know concrete still have several project projects that are that i've done years ago that are still holding up and i actually splash this stuff on my van no joke splash this stuff on my van on the very first job that i did it is still on there that is that is at least four years ago at least four years ago can't chip it off i'll show you It's all Portland cement. Literally will not come off. That's it.